the hybrid model uh, is the right way to go. Processes that are non-plant facing and standardized or rules-based is where we look to just to go into offshore. I have one of your customers tell the story of how they're leveraging the internal GPS organization for something more than just saving money. Hybrid model uh, is the right way to go. Over time, the market has matured in a way that CAT2 model uh, works uh, really well. So outsource partners will be able to bring different industry perspectives and experiences that you will not be able to get in a short period of time, which helps us to uh, make it faster to scale and realize the savings. Processes that are non-client facing and standardized or rules-based is where we look to just to go into an offshore or a near shore location, which will work as an extension of our onshore team. Examples are like accounts payable or accounts receivable activities. GBS, and we, we have our internal brand called OneSource, we couldn't graduate to, to even thinking about adding a greater level of value over just cost cutting. After we kind of proved over like a three year, four year stint, anything that came to one source was one third cheaper through a mix of uh, BPO, process reengineering or RPA. You can now start talking about value, like benefits to the company that's over and above because it's, it's about getting product in the hands of consumers, the right product, the right consumer, at the right time. Target a couple of key customers that really value you and use them as an example of how your equivalent front of the counter, like a non just cost cutting story, cultivate that. And then have one of your customers tell the story of how they're leveraging the internal GPS organization for something more than just saving money, right? And then what you'll see is that their peers will start to view GBS a little bit differently.